With my first few layers of the Too Soft Vanilla Mix complete, I am now adding flat white to this custom Rick and Morty 5950 New Era Snapback Hat. You can refer to some of my previous videos for a better explanation on how to use the Too Soft Mix. I have all my images printed out and now I am mapping out exactly how they will fit on the front of the hat. Time to add the colors and I am using an angular shader from Angelus Direct in a size 1. These larger blocks of colors will not only act as my undertones, but will also give the hat a glowing effect. I'm using Sorol chalk paper to transfer my images onto the hat. I want my hot pink undertone to show beneath the finer details in the front.
All of the tiny work is completed using a Princeton Select size 18 short liner. I am keeping part of the Seurat stencil taped on so not to lose my line work. Time for line work and highlights. Now adding the final details to this custom Rick and Morty 5950 new era snapback hat. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me through my Instagram or my website. Both links are down below, as are links to all the products I used in this video. Big thanks to Angela's Drake for the paints, and thanks guys for watching.